Science 3, Quarter 2, Week 5, Heredity, Inheritance, and Variation. This is our lesson for today. Learning competency with code. The learners should be able to identify the observable characteristics that are passed on from parents to offspring. Living things have the ability to reproduce. To reproduction, living things make copies of themselves so that their kind continues to live on earth. Just like plants and animals, they produce their own kind. Human mothers give birth to their young ones, just like female dogs, cats, pigs, and dolphins. Other animals like birds, lizards, frogs, and fishes lay eggs. When living things reproduce, certain characteristics of parents are transferred or passed on to their offspring or children. Animals, plants, and human beings are living things. Living things have different parts on their bodies and have different uses like eyes, nose, ears, tongue, and skin, and other parts of our body. On the other hand, plants have leaves, stem, flowers, fruits, and roots. Animals can reproduce creating offspring of their own kind. Animal offspring share similar observable physical characteristics or traits with their parents. When we say traits, these are characteristics that can be observed in a living thing. When living things reproduce, they pass on traits to their offspring such as the color of the skin, shape of the face, eye shape, nose, and length and size of ears. These traits are inherited from their parents. Animals like cats, dogs, carabaos, goats, cows, and pigs are born alive. They are called viviparous animals. While birds, chickens, and ducks are hatched from eggs. They are what we call oviparous animals. The pictures of animals on the left side show their offspring. The parent animals look alike their young. They have similar traits and characteristics. How about plants? Many plants grow from seed, but they can also grow from other plant parts like the stem, leaf, and root. Let's have some examples. This is a strawberry plant. Plants like strawberry and spider plant produce new plant through its horizontal above ground stem. Do you know this plant? Very good! This is an aloe vera plant. Aloe vera plant can grow new plant by placing a cut leaf on top of the soil and keep it moist for a few days. How about humans? 
We can also inherit traits from our parents, even from our ancestors, grandfathers, and grandmothers. Now, look at your parents. What physical features did you inherit from them? Aside from physical traits, mental, special talents being proficient in math, writing, singing, drawing, and other talents can also be inherited from our parents or ancestors. Now, what special talent did you inherit from your parents? Now, let's have some activities. Let's find them. Find the youngs of the parent animals. Write the letter of the correct answer. Number 1 A B C D or E Find the youngs of the parent animal. Number two, find the young of this parent animal. A, B, C, D, or E. Find the young of this parent animal. Is it letter A, B, C, D, or letter E? Find the young of this parent animal. A, B, C, D, E. Find the young of this parent animal. Is it letter A, B, C, D, or E? Activity 2. Let's draw it. Draw a happy face on the blank if the sentence is correct. And if it's not, draw sad face on the blank. Animals are living things. Number 1. Animals are living things. Happy face or sad face? Number 2. Animals cannot reproduce. Animals cannot reproduce. Happy face or sad face? Number 3. The youngs of the animals inherited the face of the parent animals. The youngs of the animals inherited the face of the parent animals. Happy face or sad face? Number 4. Animals can have offspring with their same kind. Animals can have offspring with their same kind. Happy face or sad face? Number 5. A dog can have a cat as an offspring. A dog can have a cat as an offspring. Happy face or sad face? Activity 3. Let's write it. How do these plants produce plants of their own kind? Write your answer in the table. Part of the plant where it grows. Seed, stem, leaves, or roots. 
These are the parent plants. Number one, mango. Number two, corn. Three, rice. Four, spinach. And five, ginger. Activity 4. Let's find out. Find out the physical traits you inherited from your parents that you see on your body, face, or even the mental or special talents that you have. Discuss and answer the activity with your parents. Characteristics The color of the skin Shape of the eyes Hair, is it straight or curly? The height The shape of the nose And special talent Describe the physical traits of your parents and your own physical traits that you inherited from them. Thank you.